Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, my name is Ferris and today I just unboxed a gas refrigerator from Smad um, and in today's video I'm gonna introduce you guys some features about this refrigerator and also how to use it in three different ways and in the end I will um, tell you how does this refrigerator work um, this refrigerator can be powered by three different sources of energy um, it includes uh, 110 volt AC and also the gas, like this. Um, it includes a regu regulator and also a tube. And also it can be powered by 12 volt DC. Okay, first let's look at the control panel of this uh, refrigerator. It actually um, comes with the transparent plastic cover but it comes in separate to prevent the damage. And as you can see, this dial is for switching from three different power um, sources. Like you can simply switch from 12 volt DC to the gas, and also you can switch to the 110 volt AC. And this is for the, for the gas function. And if you don't do not know how to operate this refrigerator, refrigerator um, in gas, I have posted another video to teach you guys how to um, use it in the gas mode. Then let's look at the interior of this refrigerator. The black white cabinet will never go out of style and you can use it in your home kitchen um, or basement and garage and also the office and trucks. As you can see there are two um, adjustable shelves and you can adjust it into six different levels and also there are two door racks which can be removable as well so it's very easy for you to clean up. Okay, next, um, I will introduce you guys the working principles of this kind of refrigerator. And as you can see, this is the back of this refrigerator. It's called three-way fridge because it uses three different sources of energy to heat the coolant within the fridge, which will enable the fridge itself to get cold. Um, it uses um, the 12 volt DC electricity or 110 volt AC electricity and also the gas. This fridge gets cold using absorption, um, which is the absorption process. But your fridge at home is the compressor fridge. So this kind of fridge uses the chemicals to make the elements inside the fridge cold which absorb the heat from the inside of the fridge then make the fridge cold. As you can see the big um, pipe here, um, this big pipe we call it boiler, boiler uh, which is the heating elements. The boiler is heated up by one of three things um, which include uh, the gas and also the 12 volt heating elements or 110 volt AC element. And uh, the part down here, this one is the gas burner, and this part uh, we call it a condenser. And there is a part down here is the small tank. Yeah, and this tank contains the chemicals which make um, the whole fridge work. And the chemicals in this tank include water, ammonia, and hydrogen. They are using the boiler as the engine. So I will tell you guys how does the uh, this refrigerator work. So as I said, in this tank, there are three different um, liquid, like water, ammonia, and also hydrogen. Um, so first, the water and ammonia travel from the tank <coughs> down to this tube, then to the boiler. And then um, the heating element heat up, uh, heat up the mixture of water and ammonia, then the water and ammonia liquid turns into the vapor. The vapor goes up from the boiler 
Then there are some ribs in the tank are designed to condense the water vapor back to the liquid. So all the water vapor stops here, just stop here at this point. Then the water liquid drips back to the tank here, which is ready to be reheated and processed again. The ammonia vapor moves up into the condenser. So this part is the um, condenser. So when the ammonia vapor travel through the condenser, um, the ammonia vapor turns back into the liquid and drops down this tube here. As you can see, once uh, it reaches this part, this tube here, and travels this way towards the fridge, then it meets the hydrogen gas. The hydrogen gas from this tank is introduced. The hydrogen gas is also in this tank, but it will be introduced into this tube also. So once the hydrogen gas and ammonia liquid meet, the ammonia liquid absorbs the hydrogen gas and a rapid decrease in temperature happens. So which will make the cool box um, go to zero centigrade or even lower. Once the ammonia and hydrogen mix has cooled down and gone through the cool box, the two will start cooling and falling back down these tubes, separating into gas and liquid, and meeting back in this tank for the process to start again. Um, the mechanical control panel is on the top um, of the interior and you can adjust the temperature level from level 1 to level 5 and also there are two LED lights inside which will make the interior of the refrigerator brighten even during the night time but um, I have to remind you guys if you use the gas as the source of energy uh, actually these two LED lights will not work but if you use the DC um, the 12 volt DC or 110 volt AC these two LED lights will um, be working normally uh, alright that's all about the working principles of this refrigerator and uh, by using the gas you can use it in outdoors like when you go uh, for camping and also you can use it in your caravan or um, your truck so I didn't tell you how to operate um, this refrigerator in the gas mode but I have posted another video about how to operate the three-way um, refrigerator in different sources of energy so if you are interested um, in my video don't forget to subscribe us and I will keep updating some um, useful videos about the home appliances thank you guys